Hello, I am Tolheim, and welcome to Clockwork Empires. This is a game I've had my eye on for quite a while, and it's just left early access, in it's version 1, so I thought I would give it a go. So it seems like... All I can do now is the temperate, and I have different types of loadouts. So there's loadout difficulty and biome difficulty. I guess I should try and find one which is 1-1, one, one. here we go. Standard Expedition and Temperate Biome. Let's kick this off. It's difficulty 1 out of 3 for all. Dominant Foreign Presence, the Novarus Imperia. And I've got Swamp, Alpine, Freshwater Lake, Temperate, Moist, Mixed Forest, Ocean, High Prairie and Desert. Let's go. So am I going to have any idea what I'm doing? Probably not, but let's have a look here. Okay, so up, down, left and right, zoom to location, rotate, zoom in, zoom out, and space paused. Let's go. Okay, so what do I want to do first? I guess... Um, okay, well, I've played this a bit, so... It's still like it was in the past. Put down a large stockpile and flatten this terrain, I think. So, I'll flatten that terrain so I can start building on it. Overseers, no assignment. Flat terrain. We have unassigned worker pool. I've got two unassigned workers. Let's put them onto that job. So, yeah, see so if these guys can get jobs. So, one group's got flattened terrain. That's one job, so let's try and do some other jobs. Currently they're picking up stuff and putting it away. I guess I want to clear this terrain. Can I do that? Oh, it might be in here. Uh, plant grass, plant shrubbery. Dismantle objects. Oh, is it here? Clear terrain. So if I clear this terrain. There we go. So I'm flattening that terrain and then clearing it. That'll be good, good for jobs. And then I'll start building a house, maybe, or something. Let's build a labour bunkhouse. Let's put it here. Try and avoid that rock. Okay, so I need 15 stone, 7 stone and 15 wood, which I have neither. So, there we go. Let's get a door. Can I rotate the door? There we go. And then let's put some bunks in. It's made in the carpentry. So you get a carpentry place. Okay. Just click there. Didn't mean to do that. Okay, so let's put this here. There we go. So we've got three bunk beds. I need to get a carpentry place. Let's get the workshops. Carpentry workshop. Let's put it up here. I need lots of stone, need lots of wood. Let's put that there. I have to admit, it's um It's definitely the performance has definitely improved a lot since I played the the open access. Having said that, I also had got a new computer since then, so that might be the reason. Let's chop these trees and mine some stone. Let's do that. Okay, so who's doing what? Chop trees, construct building. Flat terrain. No unassigned workers. So I'll just leave them to it, I guess. So yeah, so each of your colonists have stuff like memories, quality of life, different emotions. We've got happiness, despair, anger, fear. Currently idle because off shift. We've got shifts. Change her name. A loner stone? I quite like a loner stone. I'll leave that. Oh, there's a mini map. Okay. Okay, right. So here's my town. Here's my job assignments. Faction relations. Hostile to bandits. Friendly to Clockwork Empire. Hostile to Novarus Imperia, but neutral with the Republic, Republic mechanic. And, oh man, I know the how I'm supposed to say that. Gross Herzog Inentum 
von Stalmark. I'm neutral with them. And yeah. Looks like everyone's taking a break. So once I have a housing and a carpentry workshop, I should probably start thinking about fields. Let's put a maze field there. You to research th this technology in the laboratory. Interesting. That's new. You got a laboratory. I want to get a kitchen. Let's put a kitchen over here. Uh, let's put door. I need a stone oven. Need anything else? I have no idea. Let's leave this for the time being. Have I got that? Where do I see my jobs? Total population, 9 out of 9. Work cap capacity, 4 out of 6. Attract more overseers by building or improving the overseer housing to increase capacity. I've got no barracks, miners, naturalists, or laboratory workers. We need to build those buildings. Oh, build or improve labour housing to increase capacity. I need to make sure I'm building labour houses. Okay. Actually, let's, um... Let's speed this up a bit. Everything looks to be going reasonably well so far. Show my job assignments. Everyone's working away. Which group's idle? Because two groups are idle. Job's unassigned. I guess it's going to be assigned soon. I may need to... Can I expand my building? After I've already placed it. Let's have a look. Construct building. Uh, can I expand this? Yes. Oh, that counts as a different building. Counts as a different building. Okay. Where is it connected? Will the wall get knocked down, like, later? I don't know, I'll, I'll uh, wait and see. But it seems that the carpentry workhouse has been finished building, so that's good. We'll chop down all those trees, give me lots of wood. It's only the front door, though. Everyone's asleep there because there's no bunk beds. Everyone's just sleeping on the floor. Oh, sweet, I've got more population. Um, unassigned worker pool. Okay, let's um, try and get all these guys kind of laid out equally. What does this mean? Oh, she's a scientist. These are her skills. Science. Jolly good at science. But inept at like everything else. Perhaps I don't want someone on the uh, science. Person to Smith. Do I have a carpenter? Stone working. Stone working. Na naturalist. A military leader. I look like I actually don't have anyone that's really that great at carpentry. Oh well. Ample housing have drawn colonists to my city. Okay, can I can I delete this wall? To do, two windows, three cots, quality four or better. Oh, so the better the... the better the building quality, the um... The better the population cap. Okay, so I should build some more stuff. I should get two windows. How do I put windows in? There you go. Just put a window here, and... There you go, let's put a window here. What else can I do? Three cots. Quality of floor or better. How do I increase quality? Can I just destroy that wall? It's like some of my people's actually stuck. I don't know. Um.
I'm, I think I'm demolishing that second lower class house. I'm not sure I can expand buildings. That's, that's a lesson learned. Done two windows, three cots, quality four plus or better. How do I get quality of four plus or better? I don't know. So the cots need something from the carpentry workshop? Like workshop product. Planks? Paper stacks. But what is that? What do, what do cots need? Oh, is it maybe not carpentry? Maybe it's something else. Workshops, kitchen, ceramics. Foreign outreach, trade office. Mine, public services, public house, barbershop. I don't know what I need. Okay, right, well. To sign someone. Carpentry skill 2. Assign her. And select a product. Let's get some planks. Get five planks. Okay. And then I need more wood, I guess. So let's chop down some more wood. Chop trees. There we go. Uh, okay. Beds reduce quality, while decor modules increase quality. Let's add some more modules to it. Okay, so... Let's get... Carpentry workshop. That's carpentry workshop. Lower bunkhouse. Let's get... Simple cabinet. We'll cross something made in the, in the carpentry workshop. some of these. Why is it saying no? I don't know. Let's put three cabinets in. Oh, it says what it requires. Okay, okay, well, give me a second. So if I go onto the building, Go into modules. Requires a cot, which is made in the carpentry workshop, from two planks. To make two planks. Okay. Base assembly workbench, probably need that. That's probably what I need. Decor workbench. Advanced workbench. Who knows? Let's put some windows in. Increase the quality of the housing, improving the mood of those who work and live there. Let's do that. Okay, so... Houses are coming on quite nicely, I think. Get some planks. Seem to workshop. No unassigned workers I can add to things, never mind. Actually, take someone from there and put them to the carpentry workshop. Okay. Um, everything's going reasonably okay. Speed this up. Oh my! The fish people have arrived. What should we do? I certainly didn't see anything. I'm going to deny the fish people exist, rather than shoot them on sight. That's my first decision. So that's the first eldritch thing I've encountered so far. Actually, I might get a second, second labour bunkhouse built, a bigger one. There. Give it a front door. I'll give it two windows. 
three cuts. And let's put some cabinets in. Clothesline. Improve the quality of the place. Let's put them on this wall. There we go. Quite nice. And this place. Oh, what do I want to do here? Modules is a kitchen. Easy, easy delivery and export of materials. Let's put that down. Got a stone oven. Hanging pots. Let's make the place look a bit nice. A couple of windows. Lower class rug. Improve the quality. Exterior lamp. Let's put let's put exterior lamp some places. Look nice. There we go. Let's speed up some time. I think I've got a lot of jobs ordered for people to do. What do I, what do I want to choose now? Let's build, an let's build an assembly workbench. Get one of those. Oh, it's two logs. How many logs do I have? Eight. Okay. That's fine. Let's chop some more trees, maybe. I think I'm getting a good hang of this now. So, what can I build now in the workshop? Workbench. Cots, here we go. Got three cots. I need planks. I need six planks. I've already got five. Let's get six anyway. Might get cots. Okay. We're on the move up. Let's um, unassign this guy. Put him on cot duty. Workshop duty. And speed up time. Oh look! A deer. Forage. Oh! Where are some mushrooms? Quite like him in a little village. Time of day, tea time, toggle building view. Oh, I can see what it looks like from the outside. That's quite cool. What is that? Boxed cots. Oh, I'm getting the cots. Okay. People actually um, complete their jobs pretty quickly. Which is quite nice. But no one is working on the farm. Oh, I've got to assign an overseer. To the farms. Okay. So V Smith Temper and Zeus Collier, you are now farmers. So I'm gonna have fourteen. The labour population cap is a maximum of five. And this is how you improve it. Building quality. I see, okay. Alright. So I've got my three cots. Let's get another three cots. Let's get some more planks. Six more. Uh, is there anything else I want?
Three times plank required for a ceramics workshop. And chemistry. Okay. My kitchen, is my kitchen ready? Assign an overseer to the kitchen. Let's assign... Zeus Collier is assigned to... Let's get Abigail Soup. Because Soup's in the name. Now we've got this. It's like to workshop Fungus Stew. Something one I can do. Maze chowder. Let's get, let's get some fungus stew. Five fungus stew. There we go. Some raw fungus. I think I saw some raw fungus around. I don't know. Oh, yeah, there's some. Lots of raw fungus. My fungus stew. People are sleeping in the cots. Great success. Building quality is now minus one. So I have to do quite a lot to improve the quality of the place. Let's, um... What else can I put in here? A rare painting. Building quality plus seven. Large clothesline. Put some of those in. Lower class rug. That'll improve the quality of the place. Hopefully enough. So what it requires. Box simple cabinet made in carpentry workshop. All the stuff's made in the carpentry workshop. Exterior lamp is made in the metalworks. Okay. I guess you want everything to have plus six in quality, to make your people as happy as possible. Spice rack, wooden order, bookshelf, simple chair. Maybe I need the decor workbench, here we go. A space for a decor, decor workbench? Ah, oh, more immigrants. Excellent. Um, decor workbench. What is, what is that? I can't see what that is. I think that's what I am... I think that is what I am making, though. So that's good. Let's do two times speed. Apply some of these unassigned workers. Let's get some more farmers. People working in the carpentry workshop. Family research. Someone has made a horrifying discovery about his family tree. Interesting. Every ounce of mental peace and confidence he once had has been shattered by this revelation. That's lovely. Okay, so I'm speeding ahead of the tutorial. Survival, activity tip. I am ignoring all the tutorials, never mind. But I'm making fungus stew, so everything's good. We're not gonna starve to death, we can eat fungus. Okay, I want more cots. That's decor workbench. Get three more cuts. I think I need some more wood. So let's chop down some more trees. Chop this tree, and these trees, and those trees. And all my 
people are assigned this. Actually, it's unassigned. I'll try one person, one worker to each overseer. Okay, there we go. Is that a deco workbench? I don't know what that is. Dismantle that module. Let's put a deco workbench in. There. There we go. I think maybe I might need a metal works. Carpentry, kitchen, ceramics workshop. I need bricks before I can get the metal works, so I need ceramics first. Okay. Sweet. Safety. I need to find foreign outreach, find the barracks. Oh, I haven't got a military at all. Okay. So I need to build a barracks. It's probably good for me to build it up here. There we go. Wait till it's finished before I uh, start putting down modules. I got too many assignments. Need to wait a bit before I put down more assignments. So everyone's having a nice break. My maze is looking good though, though it has got high flammability. It's a bit bad. I'm learning bit by bit. Sweet, I've made five mu five fungus stew. Let's make some more. Let's make five more. Get plenty of food. Maddened by despair. Abigail Soup has become maddened by despair. She may act erratically until she found solace one way or other. Public house will speed up the process. She's currently just dancing in the lower class bunkhouse. Now she's cowering. She's poorly fled. Desperately hungry. She's feeling starvation. I've got, I've got 20 fungus stew here. Maybe she doesn't like fungus stew. Oh, I've got plenty of maize, okay. Oh, you can move the queue of the, um... I don't know. One bric-a-brac needed. Okay, so let's build... One, six bric-a-brac. So I'll need... How many more planks? Plenty of planks. That I need more wood. She got quite a lot of wood. I think our soup's still really struggling. Could use better quality food. Okay, well, soon I'm gonna get maize soup for people. That'll be good. Got sausages here. Yeah, I can only, if I improve the quality of my bedrooms, I'll get happier people. Okay, wait, do windows improve quality? Have a look. No. What two windows do... ...allow for one extra person. So, that's good. Let's speed this up a bit. Ominous dreams. 
Vesta Euler claims to have a strange dream and speaks of it. A mouth opened in the wall and it sprued forth oily insects that filled the room. I could not breathe for they swarmed over my face. And I thought of the divine mechanic and was calm. I was comforted by the knowledge that reason would dispel the foul apparitions. Embrace the insect tide. Oh no, you decide. I think follow the divine mechanic. Interesting. One never knows what opportunity may arise, so you can I guess do a risk. Tell them to embrace the insect tide. You might get a bonus out of it. But uh I'll stick to the divine mechanic for now. Go get a chapel. Super holy. Can I actually what do I need to build a chapel? Barber shop. Two lacquered planks and bricks. Training academy. There's a lot of stuff I have the feeling I'm not going to be needing too soon. Abigail Soup is no longer maddened. She can get back to cooking. It's quite nice. Um, I've not met any bandits yet. How do I save? Okay, hit the save button. Okay, well, I think that's going to be all for now. So I hope you enjoyed and thanks for watching and have a great day.